The spring is a time of revolution. We have the Prague Spring, that was before the baby boomers, I think, and we had the Arab Spring recently, and we have things, uh, as uh, Rita suggests, things are percolating all over the world now. So, what do you see in store for this spring, Alexander? Oh, no. <laughs> are in political science and global affairs, so uh, we study a lot of politics, of course. Actually, it always struck me that revolutions usually don't happen in spring. Uh, American Revolution, July 4th, French Revolution, July 14th. In Slavic countries, for some reason, people get more angry when it's cold, so Russian Revolution in November, Czech Revolution in November. Uh, Oh, spring is spring. Um, the Arab Spring actually happened. Does anybody know why it happened? Where it where it started? The Arab Spring happened in uh, first uh, started in Morocco, and it happened uh, from a breach of security in the United States Army. Um, I don't know why they would give a private access to a hundred thousand classified documents, but they did. And he gave them to this uh, guy, Julian Assange, maybe you've heard his name. And uh, so he posted a lot of them online. And uh, what ha was happening in Morocco was that uh, the people who were living quite badly uh, got angry when they heard that the son of the king had pet lions and, and giraffes and everything. I don't know about the giraffes, but he did have a pet lion. And so a man took gasoline, poured it on himself, and uh, in English it's called uh, self-emolliate. He set himself on fire. And uh, this led to a uh, revolution in Morocco that then spread to uh, Algeria, um, Egypt, and then Syria. Uh, so this is the Arab Spring. Uh, the other spring revolution that was mentioned was... Prague. Prague. Oh yes, the Prague Spring. Um, as, a, as a fellow Slavic country, um, maybe I'm sure people here can relate. Interesting story about this Prague Spring. I see the red flag, and then I'll finish. Um, if you've ever been to Prague, you know that the streets make absolutely no sense. They go this way and that way. And there's these famous scenes of Russian tank drivers uh, looking at the map, and the Prajanki changed all the street signs. And you see these <laughs> Russian tankers just... They have no idea where they're going, so, and I have no idea where the revolutions are going in spring, even though I have a degree in political science. So. <laughs>